When I got my PlayStation first time round, um, I'm not sure when it'd have been now, probably about 97. Nine, yeah, it'd have been the Christmas of 97 because I got FIFA 98 with it when that came out. And when I got that console, it was part of a Toys R Us bundle, I believe, and it come with like six games. And then I got FIFA. So I got like seven games or something, so it was pretty awesome at the time. And one of those games was True Pinball, which I have here, not the original copy that I had. But yeah, this is um, an awesome pinball game. I really like this one, so I'm going to put it in and hit record. And the, only, the, the one thing that disappoints me about this game and so many other pinball games is the fact that it's got no save feature. You know, all I want to do is save my high scores because if you can't save your high scores for me there's not really much point in playing a pinball game. So I, I don't know whether I'm just being fickle there but something that annoys me. And to be honest this, this um, game right here I mean I haven't got the, the covers, I've only got the manual and the disc but for me, I've not played a pinball game yet with better tables. Um, the only pinball game I've kind of played to rival it would be um, that Mega Drive game, Dragon's Fury. Um, and that's just a completely different type of game. That's a completely unrealistic pinball game. Right. So it's got this funky music going on. Why is my controller not working? Um, probably because it's in... No, it's not in... Try to turn vibration off. Strange. I assumed it was because it was in analog mode. Oh, but turning the... Why, why has it done that? Because there's loads of games that aren't compatible with the analogs uh, vibration function um, so we'll go extreme sports yeah there's loads of games that uh, aren't compatible with the vibration function that still you know it still works on but for some reason it doesn't with this odd So we've got the same bloody music again. Um, and it goes when you start. So I like the um I can just work out. I like the tables, um, I like the viewpoint and I like the, uh, the graphics. And the tables are pretty decent, decently designed as well. There's plenty of features on them, etc. As far as I'm aware, they're not real tables and they're just made up, but I may be wrong, but yeah, that's just an assumption. So we've got some multi-ball going off, as you can see various bits light up and paths open as you'd expect on a, a pinball game. Animation's great, ball physics seem decent. For me, this this is the benchmark um, game for me, pinball wise. Um, every other game I play, I basically compare it to this game. Just this this is my favourite pinball game. Well, it's it's the only one really as well that I've kind of played at any length. It is. A, I'm having a bit of trouble um, getting the timing hundred percent right on my flippers, whatever you call them. Um, but that's because the, the capture device will put the uh, response time like half a second out or something, so that's the reason why. Should really get a new capture device. I'm using the Easy Cap, the uh, cheap Chinese thing, so it cost me about seven quid, but. Not great. 
It's, I suppose you get what you expect for the money, which is not much, but... They do tend to be traditional um, kind of pinball tables in this game. There's no ridiculous effects, you know. There's not like somewhere that you'll hit the ball into and it'll come up with another screen. Um, the, the only thing that will happen is something will come up on the, um, I don't know what you'd call it, kind of display on the, uh, the top where your score is. Not really sure what you'd call that kind of display. Would it be a dot matrix? I don't know. So you get the usual amount of balls you'd expect, three or whatever it is. Um, so, that's game over for that. Um, and select for menu, and then you can quit. So you don't have to reset the game to quit, which is a, a bonus. For some reason my PS3 is going mental trying to load this game. What is wrong with you man? Well this is going to be have to be a bit of filler time. Um, seeing as it's not loading. Try taking the disc out and putting it back in. I don't know what the condition of the games are, it's not that bad. I'd expect the PS3 to be able to play that. What are you playing at, man? I don't know if putting the disc in um, actually causes it to resume. I've not tried it before on PS3. I know it would have done on the, on the PS1. Looking for the data. Well, this isn't going to plan, is it? So what we'll do is, unfortunately, oh, yay, and there we go. I'm an expert at that shit, you know what I mean. Right. Hey. What? Control's not working again. Hey, what's that all about? I have to press the home button to... I don't fucking know. This, this game's obviously got issues being played on the uh, PS3, so... If you've got any experience in playing this game yourself um, on a PS3, please let me know if you've had any issues. So I'll have a look at the Viking table. There's four tables in the game. As far as I know, there's nothing to unlock. Um, they're all accessible from the start of the game. So as you can see, this is a Viking themed table, a bit different to the uh, last table in music, uh, you know, set up, style, just what you'd expect. The music's quite annoying on this one to be fair, it wasn't too bad on the extreme sports. I think it's possibly the slight delay that's fucking me up on this one. I just keep miss hitting with the top flipper and um, the ball just seems to go straight down the middle of the bottom flippers. See if we can get this time. Uh, I'll just keep missing it. So that's the, the Viking table. I suck at that one. We'll have a look at uh, the other tables. Ah, nice cup of tea. Gosh, it's gash. 
bullets to tea. So, home and it works. Random that. Baywatch. A spoof of Baywatch. No Hasselhoff included. Well, at least we didn't have any issues getting back to the main menu from that table, which is worth noting. So it could have just been a speck of dust, one speck of dust on the disc. Right, see if we suck as badly at this one as we do on the Viking table. Oh, fuck. Close call. Now, if you're going to play this on a modern TV setup, um, with the reliance on timing, obviously, with it being a pinball game, um, you might have to look at your um, delay. You know, on um, some surround systems cause a delay and some TVs you can adjust the delay on the TV to match the delay on the surround system so if you're going to play this game on a modern setup then definitely uh, make sure that's all set up correctly so you get your instant response otherwise it just fucks the controls up So we'll have a look at the uh, the final um, table, which is Law and Justice, I think it's called, which is probably my second favourite table in the game. My first being the Extreme Sports one. Welcome to main menu. Please choose to save. Please, welcome to the main menu. Please, please press the home button on your PS3 so you can actually fucking use the controller. Right. Something kind of hypnotic about that loading screen. It's out to get me. No, oh, it's attacking me! Right. Well, so I started the table and the balls and uh, immediately not gone out. And then maybe I spoke a bit too soon. God damn you, motherfucker! There's also, I think, there's also a 2D uh, mode. Because this is kind of the views isometric. And I think possibly you can select a straight 2D top down view. Um, but that can be kind of hard to follow in a pinball game because it means that the camera has to scroll up and down constantly to follow the ball. I may be wrong though, I may be thinking of a different game. So it's. That's just a quick look at all the tables. Um, it is one of my, well, it is my favourite pinball game. I don't know whether it was because it was the first one that I ever owned, but I'm a very big fan of True Pinball. Um, pissed off that it doesn't have a save feature like, but um, yeah, if you play it and you get, you know, the controls set up as it should be with no lag or anything, then. Um, yeah, it's one of the, the best pinball games out there in my opinion.